Hello. Hello. <laughs> Today we're going to have an IELTS uh, speaking mock test. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay. So before we begin, um, can you please introduce yourself? Uh, my full name is Wendy Tweebet. You also call me Jenny, so it's my English name. Um, now I'm now I'm 16 years old and I study in Tamsung High School. Where do you come from? I I come from uh, I come from uh, <laughs> I I come from a small village. Yeah, it's located in Pingfu Province. Yeah, um, I. Um, I, I, sorry, I'm, I come from a small village located in Vinh Phuc Province, it's, it's in my, it's my hometown and um, I can say that um, I have a lot of memories here and um, here in I, I, f I feel I'm very, I feel very happy because I was born here. I'm, I have a lot of, um, a lot of friendly friends, and they are, they always willing to offer me a helping hand when you, when, when I, when I am troubled. What do you it's like about the area you live in? Uh, sorry, uh, can you repeat? What me? do you like about the area where you live? Um, I can I can say that people here are very welcoming and they are also thoughtful. You know. Furthermore. Um, Furthermore, furthermore, everything here is is like is very is perfect from sceneries, scenery and some um, atmosphere here. You know, um, you can see a lot of you see a lot of spectacular scenery and some. Um, you can meet. You also meet a lot of uh, welcoming people. What things in your hometown that you do not like? Mm, actually, actually, I don't like. Actually, I don't like. You know, my relative is because um, because they they often gather and you know they they dance, they sing, they. Sometimes it's annoying me, and um, uh, and another is ana another is um, another is um, um, you know the cost of living is quite uh, is quite high uh, high. And um, and so what do people in your hometown do in their free time? Um, it also depend on their context. For example, on weekend they uh, on weekend they often like um. They often uh, sing and they often sing, sing, um, sing and do some like physical activities, physical activities, or uh, play some sports like uh, football. But in norm normal day, they normal day they. They they have they have to like have to go to work go to work so they have uh, they have f they don't so they don't have 
don't have too much time don't don't have too much time spend on on spend on doings and too much time spend for your interests as for their interests sorry okay thank you now this time we're going to proceed to your part two okay which is cue card so i'll be giving you um this cue card and you i will give you one minute to prepare you can write some notes on this piece of paper and here's a pen and then after one minute you have 90 seconds to speak so your one minute begins now Your one minute is done, so now you have 90 seconds to speak. Before you do that, I want you to tell me about your cue card first. Can you read your cue card? Uh, decry your journey you met in past and remember, and you remember well. Okay, you have 90 seconds to speak. Okay, well, I'm going to talk about a journey that I I I I miss in in the past. Yeah, it's a journey to Da Nang City, and if my memory serves me right, I made it when I when I um, when I have just finished my exam, my final exam, and. Uh, you know, it's a chance for me to do. Um, it's a chance for me to uh, like alleviate sorrow and alleviate sorrow. And um, we and I and I um, I had to I had to book airfare before. So airfare airfare and um. And I start as I start as six uh a a um at first at first I at first um actually is actually is is not my first time I I have a go to I have a gone to Da Nang but I'm but but I feel like very excited and um, and um, I can say that da, da Nang is a wonderful city because uh, is have many have the is have um, is have a lot of a lot of beaches and um, and attractive destination here. So, I'm sorry, your one minute and thirty seconds is done. So, can you please return? Okay. So, this time we will proceed to part three. The cue card is was all about the journey. So, I'll be asking questions about journey or traveling. Do you like to travel? Mm, yes, of course. Yes, of course. Because uh, traveling is one of the most effective way for everyone to, like, to expand their 
knowledge horizons about about new thing like culture, culture or um, like culture, culture or uh, customs. And um, I I can say this I'm. I can say that I'm a person who really interested in traveling because um, I want to explore new things and I hope that in the future I can become a... I can... <laughs> I hope that I can... I can like travel more place in the world. When you go traveling, what forms of transport do you like to? By air, by land, or water? As uh, um um is uh, can s I want something. I want. I want to try something new. So. I just prefer I would prefer water. Mm. And, and I um actually I I have never I have never gone traveled by uh, by 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 like by cruise or by cruise or or uh, like shift so I really want to try this which country would you like to travel to in the future um, um I go to I go to Paris yeah it's it's in my dream can country because um, when I were a little girl, my my grandfather my grandfather told me a lot about uh, French stories, uh, and I also have a little have little bit of interesting in um, French history, and I also. Uh, my friend also told me I uh, tell also like tell me a lot about 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 like um, food and about like cows in cows in in French so I um, and that's why I that's why I want to like I want to travel to Paris. Would you like to travel to space? Um, I'm sorry, can Would you, you like to travel to space outside the Earth? Um, I no, no, because I no, because I because I find it very like adventurous and I don't. I don't like this feeling. Yes. All right. Okay. Thank you so much for your time. Okay. Good luck to you. Okay. <laughs> oh my God.